guys, it's Abby. I am putting together a clean lasagna, meaning it is just a healthier version of the traditional lasagna. The great thing about lasagna, you guys, is you can do half kind of the way you want to eat it if you're following the 21 day fix and half the way your kids want to eat it or your husband. My kids, I try, try, try to get them to eat healthy and they are, they're, they're probably 70% better than they were maybe six months ago, but they still have a long ways to go. And I'm not 100% sure they would eat whole wheat noodles and that they would eat, they probably eat the spinach, so I might throw spinach on their side. Um, but they want more cheese than I'm gonna put on my side. So you can kind of um, adjust it to who you're feeding. So I'm gonna do half clean, 21 day fix approved, and half still clean, I mean, I guess technically, but not 21 day fix approved. So I already did one layer. Um, I'm gonna show y'all how I do a layer though. So, I always put a little bit of meat sauce down first. My meat sauce is ground turkey and um, tomato sauce and tomato canned tomatoes um, diced up and then I just dice up onions and garlic and I do use store-bought marinara. Um, well, I did this time because I was in a rush. Um, but you can you can just really make your own. It's basically the same ingredients, just maybe more seasoning. So I put a layer of that down. And then for my side, I do these whole wheat noodles. You do have to boil them. That's the downfall. I couldn't find any that were the no boil kind. So I just put some of these down on our side. And then on my kid's side, I put the regular white, um, no boil noodles. And then I put a little more of the marinara sauce, I mean the meat sauce, which is very healthy. I even drained, there was a tiny bit of fat from the turkey and I drained that off. And then I just spread that around. And then in my next bowl, I just mix cottage cheese with one egg and then I put in some uh, oregano and it tastes just like, let me tell you, it tastes just like ricotta. And then I do put um, a little bit of spinach on my side. I might just put it on their side. We'll see how they, we'll see how they do with that. I mean, they definitely could use a little more spinach in their life. And then I'm gonna put the cottage cheese And maybe I should have put the cottage cheese before the spinach. Oh well, whatever. Just spread it around. Just so you get yummy goodness of everything in each bite. And then I get my little 21 day fix healthy fat container for my cheese and I squish every little morsel of cheese that I can get in there squish squish it's my favorite container and then I put one container on my side Paul on my side and then I don't limit my cheese I just don't limit cheese for my kids I feel like they need the calcium they're growing so fast um, they don't eat a ton of it anyway so it's fine so I spread that on their side and then I, I'll top it with a little bit of Parmesan cheese as well um, and that's it, you guys. We have ourselves a lasagna, and it's delicious, and it's healthy, and it feeds the whole family. And if you're intimidated by lasagna because it's multiple pans and multiple steps and layering, don't be intimidated. It's super easy. It take, took me 30 minutes. I just had to make the marinara or the meat sauce. Why do I keep calling it marinara? And then I had to just add an egg in the cottage cheese and boil the noodles, and then boom, 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 put them all together, and you're done. And it's like your whole meal in one little thing. I'll probably pair it with a salad, but otherwise, that's it. No sides, no nothing else. It's done. So that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll post the recipe below.